welcome back. We're back on New Stock 93 FM. And if you're streaming on Jamaica Radio dot net, I must say thank you. Thank you so much for supporting. We're here every Tuesday night, uh, from 11, from 8 to 11 PM every Tuesday. Uh, so we have a guest here before I introduce him. Uh, I must say, you know, big ups to the print guru JA. You know, say boy, I've him little merch and things are come out. Boy, are things and girl are things and everybody are things. You know, we're buzzing around here. You understand? And I love that for us. If you're on Twitter, let us get it trending, people. Use the hashtag Boy are things after dark. Let us get it trending. So my topic for tonight is why men cheat. Right? And I did a podcast on this, soon to be released, right, Martin? Right. So we're going to be, you know, be releasing on Sunday, actually. Uh yes, and we're almost at our season finale. You know, we're doing 10 episodes per season and um, we're, you know, at nine episodes. Time really fly, Manala. Uh, you know, once again, you know, before I get into that, I must say to anybody who might have been going through something right now, this is not the end of the road, people. You know, have faith. Uh, you know, when God close a door, he could have closed one like a board door with no like angle upon it. Just know, say, I'm going to prepare for a nice glass door with gold angle and such. You understand? So we're going to discuss why I'm in cheating. I have here a guess. I'm not saying that he's a cheater. But you know, I well, I'm a bridging them there. You know what I'm saying? So they just introduce yourself for the people, let the people them know what's going on. Who are you? Yeah, man, Frank, you hear the voice, you know a woman. One voice or the done voice? Yeah, I'm the dad always answer that. Cornelia <laughs> <laughs> St. John is the name, people. Many may know me from social media, Instagram, and Twitter. Cornelia St. John. If you don't follow me on Twitter, you may follow me at Jambrisco underscore. Or you may follow me on Instagram at 876 underscore greatness, you know? Where did John Briscoe thing come from, by the way? You know, it's uh, different still. Uh, and, and the Cornelius St. John. I'm a little like brother. Ask you. I'm a little brother, I'm a thief, the name from still, because your mother call him John Briscoe. I'm say, yo, you know the name you're at? Tava Buzz. Yeah, it's Tava Buzz. So I'm going to say, here I go. I'm an older man, so I'm going to take it on. You know what I mean? Mm. So I'm going to drape it up and deal with the road with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cornelius mm -hmm. came from, I don't know if you know, legal herbalist on Twitter. No, I don't. Right, so... Legal herbalist. She was the person who had the name Cornelia. So I said the name one day. Mm -hmm. and I said, yo, you know, I want the name. Eh? But so she said, oh, you got thief, Cornelia. And you're a man. So I said, yo, watch your side. I'm going to switch it up and say Cornelia. And she's like, all right. So I said, yo, I need something for flow with that. I've always wanted a saint name. So I said, yo, Cornelius, Cornelius, St. Thomas. I said, no, that can't flow in. Cornelius, St. John. And then the rest was history. Here we are today. Must be nice. And so we're going to go into the topic a little bit, right? Why do men cheat? Why do you feel like men cheat? And why do you cheat? Come and say you must cheat before. Uh, <laughs> all right, well, I know. All right, so according to Google, right? <laughs> according to Google. <laughs> realistic expectations, anger, revenge, um, confusion, mm -hmm. lack of male social support. Mm -hmm. Um, insecurities, Facts. um, immaturity, Facts. but, um, <clears throat> mm -hmm. I'm sure we've had our own reasons, reasons for cheating. Um, yes, I've cheated before. It doesn't mean I'm a cheater, right? but, um, you've cheated before. That doesn't mean that you're a cheater. Yes. Are you saying that does, that doesn't mean that you're a cheater currently? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. That's what I'm saying. I'm not a cheater currently. As a matter of fact, I'm not in a relationship to be cheating anyways. So why did you cheat before? What was the reason? Or you didn't really have a reason? Like you just do it just because you just feel like Boy, saying, oh, here what I'm yeah. I'm gonna be honest. I'm one woman them here a stupid excuse, by the way. Yeah, it's a stupid excuse. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it doesn't justify anything, but I never really have a reason to cheat. Again, we never really have a reason to cheat. But I mean, in we're cultured that way. Mm -hmm. I'd like to say. Or, or I was cultured that way. You get me? High school, college, basically push that push that whole agenda on you as a man say, oh, here we go. And even from being a man, there's man for having Everybody enough. Everybody always it's so funny that like like we didn't mention of that in our podcast. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm going to say being a man being a sin about this yeah, from man, when man Jesus said I walk barefoot yeah. and I fix people furniture as a carpenter. But, but I draw me, I sweat. is that enough excuse or is that enough reasoning? You know, because... I know so the Jamaican culture have this thing that man for have enough woman and it's mm -hmm. a galley's thing, you know what I'm saying? But yes. is it that that also kind of swayed you, you know, out of that whole notion of yeah, man, man for have a, a bag of girl, like man for be a galley's type of thing? All right. So not not justifying it or anything, but you see, when you're there in high school, when you're there in a college, 
You can run your wildlife. You get me? Stay protected, but run your wildlife. Right. You get me? You're younger days, you experience things, you, you do your thing. But then there comes a time now where you have to, you have to get into your true self and know, say, your bigger moves that you make and you gonna really need a one partner. Mm-hmm. Because it's bugger bugger woman that gonna really work out. You get me? Okay. Where you have to go settle down at some point. Mm-hmm. And now, Mark, you settling down enough for everybody. You know? Like me. You get me everything, everything and for everybody. <laughs> you know what I'm so I don't know if you're still cheating. I'm not in a relationship, so I can't be cheating. Oh, well, that makes two of us. But yeah, I've not been in a relationship in four years, so I mean, technically, yeah, yeah. I don't really know who we are till that still. But you know, we are, we are, we are moving on from that. I don't know who we are till. Yeah. <laughs> I don't really know who we are till. That, isn't okay. It? Yeah, cause I will. Eat. People, ladies, just go and at Kareem. Anyone I don't know actually there with Kareem, just go at him right now. Here, send me a DM. <laughs> Trouble. ID, ID. Please, I thank you. Post it for you. <laughs> Dear Jim, set in. <laughs> but, yeah, man. Um, There's no justification for cheating, to be honest. I know that someone had said, uh, separate and apart from the whole men, the ego thing, mm-hmm. separate and apart from, you know, man for have enough woman thing, mm-hmm. which to me, is really actually boils down to insecurities. You know, so separate from that, mm-hmm. what about the man them that the women are not appreciative of you as a partner? That can also kind of lead you astray. You know, I'm, I'm getting to it. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, I have friends who maybe would have said, dog, you know, I've been doing so much for her and you feel like say, you're not being appreciated in the relationship, right? Mm-hmm. So you can bring the cow to the moon or whatever or, or the sun go are bringing water to the difference. moon but it's sort of like okay you bought water and the alone can bring water to the moon and mm-hmm. else can do it mm-hmm. so that kind of just make it kind of just be like yo i can't do this and women don't even realize that sometimes you and i'm not saying that women are to be blamed you know but right. what i'm saying is sometimes they don't realize that you push a man for go outside of the relationship because mm-hmm. of you, either you're nagging and my real and truly can't bother with the wallop talking and the wallop nagging and every day i come in why you can't um, put on the toilet seat and them something there? Or, you know, it's a lot of different things. Like I can you know, genuinely be at work working and I'm so busy and swamped by work. But come into a bag of argument. Oh, I'm not here for me because you did that your girl yard. That also, you know, I'm going to push you into another woman bed or arms mm-hmm. or well, something else. Well, I mean, mm. them things that happen on both ends of the spectrum. You but, get me? Um, it has a lot to do with insecurity mm-hmm. again because here happen. as a man mm-hmm. you're not a big egotistical but at the same time I am. but at the same <laughs> time you know say yo in a in a relationship it's a partnership so if you mm-hmm. are put your best foot forward and the woman i tell you say yo oh yeah carry one bottle of water and a two girl and you know some one mm-hmm. you get me at the end of the day I after like a while it. i get to you Facts. you get me it's a it i gotta get to you you're gonna go want to find solace some way oh, shape or form or another. Oh, big words. You get but, me? Mm-hmm. So what gonna really happen now is you're not necessarily gonna go out there, but you're gonna find different avenues. You get me? It just might be that a female is one. Mm-hmm. You get me, I say? So it's just a matter of I believe that you are, um, you know. If if it's a case where you go step out of the relationship, yeah, you can't leave. I mean, no, they might let me kill me because of course, people have a bag of things to say about a bag of other something. I love that. But, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, you can leave. Mm-hmm. Isn't it? Uh, my question, is sex a major component as to why I men cheat? What if you're not pleased sexually? What if me, hold on, I'm going to shake your head and I tell me no because someone is <laughs> hypocrite and liar. And I said, oh, women, I'm on your side for this episode, by the way. Let me just say this, right? And I know the whole of the man them in here, I look for me. You know, I am your savior, right, women? And, you know, if the man not cheat, I'm not telling the pies, I'm not going to ask Christ. Uh, so, is sex a major component? Because what if it is that I am not pleased sexually? Mm-hmm. Because, you know, somebody said on my podcast, which will be released on Sunday at 8 uh-huh. p.m., by the way, uh, if you're not subscribing to my YouTube channel, please go ahead at Boya Things by Kareem. Uh, but somebody had said that, what if you're in a relationship and mm-hmm. you requires or you desire for say 10 things right mm-hmm. so you have a list and then what if your partner is 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 not pleasing you 
as mm. it relates to that list, right? And what if sex is one of them? Yeah. What if the sex just boring? Like the girl just want to lay down on her back, which lay down on her back sex is not bad, by the way. I'm just said this. But the girl just want to lay down on her back and she know that the things them. And you just feel like, say, you go out there and a girl bad and a girl willing and able, like Kian, and decide, say, you know, I, you know, me do the things them. Is that a, a reason? No. No. Sir. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Sex is, sex is never it because Eero Ham. Let me tell you one. No, my Eero Ham. Mm-hmm. I can't get up and just have sex with any or anybody. Me have Fox. Me have, me have actually um, gel with you. Me have, me have feel the energy. Right. Me have, me have know where you're all about. Mm-hmm. You get me, I have, have sense. Right. You get me, I can't just get up and say, yo, Eero gone, she hot in us. Mm-hmm. I look some, I get some. You get me? It's never that. Mm-hmm. Because Eero Ham, me you know. If I sex alone, then I can stay in my relationship and teach my partner. You get me? I can always coach my partner into, into, into some spicy sex. Then if so and that's what I was asking, you know, because what my thing is this, mm-hmm. right? Enough man uses it as an excuse to say, dog, she does not please me. But I always ask, why that can't be communicated to your partner? If the woman them supposed to sit down and talk where you not do and you don't make no sense. No, but it's exactly that because here, um, a man is uh-huh. afraid to tell a woman, say, yo, Babes, you know what I like when you lay down on your back. Why? Because him no longer hear say, yo, you know what I like when you're on top of me. Mm. You get me? Or I like how when I tell you don't move, you move up and down or whatever you get mm. me to say. So, enough things are men don't address certain things because right. of ego. You get me? We try to save our ego. Fox. And that's just the truth. Okay. I, I, well, past records, but we are trending mm. number one on Twitter, by the way. Let me just say that at 9.15 p.m. Oh, yeah, I understand the things. <laughs> but, um, oh, yeah. Oh, oh it's sad. <laughs> but before we even say that, right? Um, I am trying to understand because if you're not happy in a relationship, why not either A, cut or B, try to fix it by saying, you know, say, I feel like say, I'm not appreciated. Mm. How can we fix this? Why is it that as men, we feel like as we go out the road, I will say, I look at it, we look good. We feel like we have a jump in it. I mean, I do understand that newness is, is the rave, you know, because, you know, like boy, like me, you know, I have over 40 pairs of shoes. If I go into actually over 60 pairs of shoes, but that's not the point. But if I go into a store, I'm going to see a shoes, what I want, right? Mm-hmm. Maybe I'm going to even just wear it one time. Yeah. You get me? But I just see the shoes, I'm going to just like the shoes. So that also equates to a lot of man, them go out and one party and they say, licking at them head and them see a girl and them just be like, yo, I forget this. It's like a, it's like a game. Fair enough. It's and like, yeah, it's a have, challenge. You do have a lot of men out there like that, but, um, but honestly, now I'm going to speak for a lot of men out there. You get me? Because here what happened. We've seen it from time to time. Mm-hmm. Men, men at events when event done or even in the event them under them lick and them say yo here go and them want to find an impress for one chill with from mm-hmm. now because you know say yo when the party done um we we'll go home mm-hmm. but to be quite honest <laughs> me don't really feel like say yo me can do that right you get me because when I bring home a total stranger me don't know you don't have to bring her home you can go by a lot of places me first there for thirteen thousand dollars a night Jesus. I have well, all the public places can pay all fifteen hundred dollar. What do you mean? You don't have to bring them nothing. Yeah. Well, here I'm. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not aware of these places. It's oh. the first time I'm here. Well, I can send you a list of these no, places. No, I would. I would okay, right. appreciate right, it. Right, I don't want it. I don't want it. Um. So, Rude Nisha said that on a wicked and lie though, because it is. Wait. So on a wicked and lie, but it's not about sex. Um. The realest kid. He said, sex is one of the major reasons why a man cheat. Yes. If both have different sex drives and have different levels of expectations, mm-hmm. it's going to be an issue. I mean, here what happened. Um, not to, not to, not to blaze any fires, not to, on, add, blaze fire, not, not to add cursing or anything, but, um, I'm, I'm sure that, um, someone that I've cheated with before can say, openly that a connection was made before anything sexual became so if obvious. connection did made because clearly you are miss cleo so if connection <laughs> didn't make why you step out of the relationship because i know you not tell me why you step never, out of the relationship no me tell you something i have a reason it's never so you just do it because you just want to do it no era it's never it's never uh it's never oh me i step out to find a connection it's always yo yeah somebody click mm. and you like the energy you start par mm-hmm. move from par in, 
to how I want to see you more often and then you're like, yo, how I reach you? So, so it moved from a friendship to a thing to a situation and then you're like, yo, you're welcome. Yeah, but that also boils down to you just not being happy then because I feel as if that if, if me mm-hmm. as a boy who are things, mm-hmm. see, see, get it? Boy are things. <laughs> but if me as a boy who are things, right? <laughs> sets a bum. And said so, and you know, I'm in a relationship and I'm happy. Mm-hmm. Really and truly, like nobody else is supposed to get my time, you know, because you know, are you me say and you say me. You understand? And I feel like I just want to spend all my time with you. So mm-hmm. it's once the moment that somebody else even a uh, 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 gather or I uh, get any of your energy, mm-hmm. that means that something is missing in the relationship. May I ask Christ, may I tell you the truth or God love? I mean, I mean, I agree, but we can agree to disagree. You don't agree? No, I don't. So, so why did you step out then? If if you and this girl had a connection, right? Mm-hmm. Because clearly, on our Siamese twins and I have a connection and such, right? Why would you step out if you said that you were happy mm-hmm. 100%? Why did you cheat? You just cheated just because. Because remember, you tell me, say, mm-hmm. you, we are things to you, my friend. <laughs> you tell me, say, no. You have to have a connection to, mm-hmm. to really and truly even... Yeah, we have a feel like energy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But, I mean, I understand how much energy I have, so, like... I bro. Oh. Oh, but what's been nice? <laughs> <laughs> all right, here I am. Mm-hmm. All right, well, boil it down too. Please do. I boil it down to mm-hmm. uh, energy of you have your mean, mm-hmm. right? And uh, you just connect on a different level with somebody, right? Else. Not a different level in terms of oh, something where you mean, uh, often, mm-hmm. but yeah, somebody just start par. Is your friend, is your bridging? Oh, okay, is it me? Is your friend, start is your par friend? <laughs> your penis just start dropping in your friend just so <laughs> no <laughs> no really no, actually like I'm trying to understand <laughs> no you know <laughs> but now for understand you know, when me did I go I when me did I go JC mm-hmm. and you know when me did I go all these other schools that I've started my degrees a hundred times and mm-hmm. can't do now no mm-hmm. you know me, I'm a very attentive learner you know right. so you and your friend start par mm-hmm. cool and then all of a sudden mm-hmm. You just drop in your friend just so? No, that's mm-hmm. not how it goes, okay. sir. Mm-hmm. All right. So, yeah. You, you go up on a one date. Yeah, you step in date? Yet? <laughs> what the <laughs> what? <laughs> so then you in a relationship and you connect with the girl, right? So you are connecting to communities like JPS. And you are going to tell me, you know, say, you are going to date? <laughs> I love this for you though. Yo, what's it now? Jambis what's coming and love this, brother. I'm going to ask, may I tell you the truth? I'm going to love this. Them for kill him. No, well, I'm going to kill him. I love that for us, women. You know, women, I love that for us. You know, if you would like to come to New Stock, if you would love to come to New Stock 93 FM, we are here. Right? So if you don't want to come with a plaque here and beat the boy, my dear. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? It's not foolish. All right, so. <laughs> it's a friendship and I do mm-hmm. understand you know having friends with yeah. you know the opposite sex and mm-hmm. then you know it can turn into something I'm not going to pretend and act like say, it can't turn right. into nothing because right. sometimes that's how a lot of relationships start mm-hmm. you just start par and then a one par turn into a two par and a yeah. two par turn into me and you in the bed with old clothes and all these things someone get it no. yeah no no I'm going to try you know clear it up you know yeah. for my listeners yeah mm-hmm. so, but, uh, when you cheated, because I always want to like, get this question. Mm-hmm. So you love this person mm-hmm. and you say, the person yeah, will have a connection and I love you. Yeah. Did you for any time at all think that um, if this person finds out, she's going to be hurt? Did that ever cross your mind any at all? <sighs> um, yeah, it has to. Or, or isn't it? Cross your mind. Yeah, man. Um, eventually that comes, you know, even if... Um, when you when you when you are youth and you out at door play football and you know say if your mother come catch you out there, she go whop you up. You still go out there go play ball. No. Karim, stop the foolishness. My mother is listening to me right now. My mother knows say no. <laughs> <laughs> my mother knows say my mother don't play. Yo, you still so, go out there go play ball. Man, you're mad. Until you're you see the car pass, I guess it's five o'clock pass. Yeah, say yo, me need for run going right now. Mm-hmm. You see me, you see the car zoom pass and you say, yo, here we go. We need to cut pass the ball field. So we're now equating hurting someone to playing football. Jesus Christ. That's what I understand. <laughs> oh, Jesus. No, no. Remember, <laughs> 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 we're not all the way together, so I'm try to understand slowly. No, it's not. I'm just, mm-hmm. I'm just saying, you know, you're doing something. Yes, there are consequences. Mm-hmm. There are consequences to everything that you do. Fuck. 
However, mm-hmm. it's just one of those things where I can say mm-hmm. that, all right, in the thrill of the moment, it's just like, yo, I'm going to do this. Mm-hmm. All right, it's done. And then you're like, dog, why am I do this? But you it again. Oh, my reach song. You it again? I changed it once. Oh, no. The whole time the man full of energy and when the man goes to know I cheated once. I cheated once. Michael Jackson. All right. Yes, it happened. This is it not happened. speechless. <laughs> but don't like this. It has happened on more than mm-hmm. one occasion. You see me? Mm-hmm. But um, for me, it's just, it's just call it my carelessness then. All right. Can you, and for people who said that if you love somebody, you would have hurt them. Mm-hmm. Do you think that continuous cheating, is it that you're not in love with your partner or is it that you're really... All right, question. Can you love two people at one time? That yeah, many for no first. Yeah? Yeah, you can. Yeah? Yeah, you can. Why you everybody can. say yes? Because really? you can, yeah. Okay. You can, man, without a doubt. Oh, buzzy. Mama said that. <laughs> yeah, mama <laughs> no, <laughs> who said that? I'm just buzzy. Them man, yeah. So you can. And, yeah, you can. I um, do believe. So at no point whilst you were cheating, did it ever occur to you that I uh, maybe... My partner is going to find this out and it's going to destroy her mentally. Um, so, you know, I got just bill. Or, become a fan, I feel like, so, you know, mm-hmm. when we do cheat sometimes, mm-hmm. we really actually don't think until we get catch. And when they get catch now, that's where they start to say, yo, you know what I mean? I mean it. So, you mean it. Yeah, man. Oftentimes, ask, oftentimes, it's just, it's just, you ride the wave mm-hmm. until the tsunami over. Then you sit, you sit down and you say, yo, John, you I don't see what I can't swim in right now. Yes, yes. <laughs> I'm not going to know tsunami. I'm sorry. No, but you're right. The wave until it come to an end and you're yeah. like, yo, all right, it, it really never worked the time. So when you were cheating, right? Or when you mm-hmm. have cheated, mm-hmm. is it that you, at any given point, cool? Mm-hmm. If you didn't get caught or if, if your partner never did find out, mm-hmm. would you still continue? More than likely you would. Naturally. I mean, not necessarily. Okay. Not necessarily. You know what To be honest, because here, uh-huh. um, all right. In, for example, right now, mm-hmm. you see me. Right now, I have too much things. Too much. Oh, too much. Too much. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> you're the man. You're the man. I say right now, I have too much. I'm a key on the boy. I'm not talking about that. No, man, I have too much things at hand dealing with, and it's just a case where you here, I'm. I'm not sure if I have this bag of bag of woman. It's, 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 you know, can't do it no more. Okay. You get me? Do you think that someone can be, uh, um, is it compulsive? I, I don't know what I look for. Like a compulsive cheater? I mean, yeah, yes. you can, you can, it, you do have compulsive cheaters. You feel like someone just can't help it? Because what I know though is that, you know, some men cheat because it's, it's so accessible and because we can, right. you know, like someone, I have a reason for cheating, my brother. Them can't have them girl at them yard, you know, and them can just go to just to buy two little cheese patty from Juicy Beef and just <laughs> believe, say, the girl would have served them a, a patty, Hot. the girl have our balls, <laughs> you understand? Right and away. right, right now, it's not just the beef patty alone you pay attention to, there's a other, you know what? Yeah, so, you know, someone really and truly can't help it. True. Um, so, you were a cheater, and if mm-hmm. you go back in a relationship, you know that it's not worth it to cheat again. Yeah, and... In order to get myself together, mm-hmm. um, with life in general, you know, um, acquire some assets and some things, and uh, you know, buy things, yeah. So Fox. we have to, we have to, we have to do things. You get me? I say, we put things in place, and no say, yo, if I decide to go back that route, or when I decide to go back that route, it has to be from a stronger standpoint mentally. What I really appreciate though, and you know, fun and jokes aside, I really mm-hmm. do appreciate the fact that you, you realize your downfall and you realize that this was not it and you're willing to, to ensure that the next time you just know say, oh, Ray. but you know, you have someone with them just not here. Someone can have, my thing is this. Yes. Yeah. You can have body part woman. You understand what I say? You can't have your wifey and you can't have a side chick, but how much side chicks you want to have? Why only for have four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten? Is it that you're that insecure in yourself that you deserve or you require so much attention? Because we don't show it is insecurities, but not ask guys. I'm on tech and we can we can afford, you know. And by afford by affordability, I not necessarily mean monetary value. Mm. I'm on tech and we can afford because here go on. Is your energy. Mm. You get me I say? Is your time. Right. It's even your money. 
So if it is that you can afford for 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 offer yourself, yes, or offer yourself, yes, or offer yourself, yes, or without mentally being being mm. shifted or shaken by this, then you yeah, gotta do it. Here's why me can't cheat, or I'm not gonna say me can't cheat because I know I have cheated. Um, here's why you don't cheat anymore. No. I- <laughs> 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 uh, okay, you know what? I wouldn't necessarily say that I've cheated because they are the man just won't get a one up, you know. I'm realize that. But what I'm saying is, um, at the end of the day, it's night. But separate from it being night, um, I feel as if that you see sometimes. Well, for me personally, mm-hmm. but I don't know about you, but for me, uh, <laughs> please save this so we can read it after the break here. But for me, I kind of feel as if that. Um, there are a lot of times when people are in relationships with me and we're not really and truly in a relationship. You understand? So, like, you can say me either, but really, me never tell us me either. So, so if me even step out and I'm really cheating because I've never confirmed to you that we're, you, w- w- we're in a relationship or we're a couple. But for me personally, I can't have a bag of relationships, you know, because mm-hmm. me is like this. You see, if me and a girl are talk, no. On my step out of the relationship, mm-hmm. for go do something else. So the next p- person or the next girl, I gotta get all my attention. You understand? I'm gonna just start breeze you a little bit. When I know how some wanna do it, when I have four or five different women, when I have only a strength. Here's here's what I've been told. Right? Right, before you go back to what you've been told by mm-hmm. the Bible, we're going to take a quick break. You understand? And then we'll fall back. But thank you so much for joining Boy Things After Dark. Come, welcome, welcome back to Boy Things After Dark. My name is Kareem Boy Things. And we're here with a, a cheater and we're discussing why men cheat. Uh, before I get into it, I must say thank you for those who are tweeting. I know some of me and say, I not pay attention to the timeline a week time, but it is a lot going on here. Really we are trending number one on Twitter and I must say thank you guys. Keep it up. Um, yes. <laughs> so we're back here with Mr. Jambrisco or, or we won't Elias call it, Saint right? Jam. Our, our or Mr. Cornelius sent to John. Brisco. Uh, so it, somebody actually sent in a message on WhatsApp. And she was saying, uh, how you and the next girl click and you're in a whole relationship. But just now I get it. When is it going to be calling time? Because first of all, <laughs> sir, if you're in a relationship and you notice you're starting to flirt with someone mm-hmm. and it's going elsewhere, you stop it. Before you answer that though, would you consider flirting cheating? Because I do consider flirting cheating. No, I don't. Put away the money. No, I don't. I don't. And and listen. No, no, no. Listen. It's not. It's not just from my end. It's not just from the man's um perspective, brother. If your woman look good, man, I got approach her. No, yeah, a man approaching you. No means say you must um take the advance or whatever the case is. But chat a little, have a conversation. Yeah, but chat a little, have a conversation can also equals to you being inside of someone else that you don't should be inside of. Yeah, man, right. I promote that. Man, I say that. That's yeah. not why I'm here today. I'm but, <laughs> but that is the reason I would say that cheat, um, flirting is cheating because I'm always a citizen. You know, and, you know, women, like, just women Flirt do this enough. enough. Um, for instance, if I'm in a relationship and I know that this person likes me, Zine, and you send me a message, I'm not going to respond. Mm-hmm. Um, but it's how you respond and it's how, how frequent are you responding. Yeah. Because you responding equals to, yeah, my know say you like me and this is giving you ample um, um, time and thinking to say, hey, going to? yeah, man, I'm up for what you're up for. That's why me, that's a threat is cheating. Because if me and you there, and me even see my vision just even forward and I mean, no man. Here I am. Um, I mean, I've been in a relationship, and my woman come to me and say, "Yo, watcha, man, I say X, man, I say Y, man, mm-hmm. I say Z," and it's like, "Yo, so you know, answer the man." Yeah, you I mean, me? the man them can say X, Y, Z, but you you know, supposed to say the whole alphabet back to the man them. No. So once you go A to Z, a trouble. Man, I ask. So you know, again, you can easily just say. Yeah, you know, so I like it, babe. And then she can respond and say, eh, okay, but I'm in a relationship. Mm-hmm. And then, you know, the man continuously I message you. You all are saying emoji, winking. Where are wink for? You have one eye? Something is wrong with your eye? Your eyelash dropping in your eye, miss? What are you winking I for? That. There's nothing to wink. 
So yeah. that's why I would say because you're giving an invitation, you're giving an invitation mm-hmm. for the other party to then say, "Oh, I have a chance." Me know, oh man, thinking, you know, brother, you that's understand? True. And that's you said, so no, bam, and you're going on DM, and you kind of, kind of see how how she's responding. Yeah. It's based on her response. Yeah, you can no, know if you have a chance. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know, ask Christ. You know I was a boy, boy, a long time, you know. A boy, you know, back in my days, you know. Um, my just kind of read one and few things on Twitter. Um, Danzi, it's Danzi said that you can love two people at the same time. You can't be in love with two people at the same time. In love and loving is two, is two, totally no, different. No, we, so. we, we know it's two different right. things. Um, can but can you be, be in love with two, two people, people at the same time? time? Oh. No. Uh, Leader fifth. All right, and um, Scorpio chick then she says some of them dirty money are just not deserve no no good girl. Gala gave the world and you're going to cheat on her and expect her to stay. His, you're full of it's like crab. True. And then somebody said, just an open relationship. This is at this banana. She said, just an open relationship or poly relationships instead of cheating. Find someone yeah. who likes the rush and newness as well, which is easy. Rather than trying to be um, monogamous and can't be monogamous. Yeah. And I'm, I'm going to just feel like if you realize that this is just not for you, communicate that because what if your girlfriend is okay with that i mean we spoke about open relationships mm-hmm. last week mm-hmm. uh you know so so what if it is that your partner would it's be okay fine. with it? like you don't know true yeah but we're going to start taking some calls um because we know it's so enough to have wally but things to say. um you know so once again thank you so much for letting us trend on twitter our our digital number is 876-294-0275 that's once again, that is 876-294-0275. Our Lime contact number is 876-212-9824. So those are our contact numbers. Whoa. <laughs> Somebody I call already? God, no? I do. Yo. Yo. Yeah, I understand me, so I I do appreciate it. We have a call on the line. Hi, good evening. Thank you for calling Boya Things After Dark. Who am I speaking with? Hello. Yes, hi, good evening. Hi, Carrie, Miss Shelby. Oh, whoop. Hi, Shelby. <laughs> but <laughs> Fleek. <laughs> Fleek. Hi, Shelby. And whoop. <laughs> would you like a credit for tonight or or no? No, I'm going to start a credit. Oh, oh, oh. I, can you just speak up just a little bit louder for me, please? And I'm about Karim, you're the one who is low. I'm low. I'm going to make my engineer start this out. I'm going to understand. Are you hearing me now? Yeah, I'm hearing you. Are you hearing me? Yes, I'm hearing you oh, well. Yeah, Thank yeah, you so okay, much. So right. So, so. Mm-hmm. so let's, you're talking about men who cheat, right? Oh, God, yes. First of all, you have Wally Quachitas in your studio. My Wally Quachitas where? In your studio. Ooh, <laughs> Would you like to um elaborate on that, please? There is a certain person mm-hmm. in your studio mm-hmm. that he would cheat on. Did he cheat on you? <laughs> no, he cheated on his girlfriend with me. What? Oh, but uh, what? Did, hold on. <laughs> hold um, on a second. Please. <laughs> I I I. I, I, I <laughs> should forget for either. I let me go back to um. <laughs> my, my, all this combobulated so, so this certain person who's in my studio and we don't have to call his name that is perfectly fine yeah, yeah, um, yeah. so he has cheated on his girlfriend with you were you aware that he was also in a relationship at that given moment of course got people being nice oh, oh so people might nice of course that's me and I'm my other brain you said you got in a relationship and take over or you was okay no, with no, just no, being a sir so you just I go and bum fit. I'm on the side as usual. So did his girlfriend or wife find out about you at any given point? She did. And what? Um, and mm-hmm. apparently this she nice was, like rice. She <laughs> was afraid of me. She thought that I was gonna beat her. And oh, so, oh, 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 what, so how she feel afraid? Say so you are gonna beat of her me, for fear, man. Because apparently the guy is madly in love with me. Wow. So it's so like this man <laughs> expressed crazy. to her that, you know, say, my love, my side. Was it that case or, or I no? I don't know when tell her. Uh-huh. Wow. Is this a man I trust for two, shall we? Harry, I'm always talking to. But, but quick question before you go, though. 
did you at any given point tell him that yo this is not right or you never really care because people think nice and so you just feel like say a girl man forget people tech nice. that, is team business and PR business. that is true my friend and i do applaud you for that congratulations <laughs> <laughs> foolishness <laughs> no 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 what do you mean Man's supposed to keep him, him himself in check. Mm -hmm. You get me, but at the same time, at the same time, what? Chef, no, say yo. Oh okay. yeah, what? Just hold it. You can't do all them things. Like me, me. The, me go she girl, never got to the girl. Me. It's the dirty yeah. man in my studio. <laughs> I feel fault because he was going no. Him should have never make the wife even find out about the side in the first place. When you got KFC and you buy a bucket of chicken, do you prefer the chicken or you prefer the coleslaw? Chicken. I don't mind the yes. chicken, right? Yeah. So, your chicken, so eh? I said, the cheetah said the corn, but corn, but and corn is aside. <laughs> you know, I said, that boy, you forget eating. <laughs> but thank <laughs> you, so, thank you so much for calling Shelby. Finally, I do appreciate you for calling boy. I think You're after welcome, that, love. all right, bye. Mm. Yes, see, yeah, all life got do Mr. Cheetah, you're in here, and look at the people them coming up, back up boom, the studio, and all these things. Man, I love this theater, then I better. Yeah, but him, but no. Uh, well, I don't know who said it. I wasn't looking. But um, that that gentleman is cheating and bossing. That's crazy. I don't like that for you. Nah. I, I don't love that for you at all. But I'm not even call it you. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, him, him. We're not <laughs> so we're here discussing. We're here discussing why men cheat on boy things after dark. On new start. Boy things after dark. Things after dark. Things after dark. Yes, yes. And our contact numbers are for Digicel. It is 876-294-0275. And for the Lime, it is 876-212-9824. We have a call. The person hung up. Okay. Um, so we're going to do another giveaway. I don't even know how I should do this in a camera. No, so if you, the first person and Davian, mm -hmm. just check the hashtag. The first person that actually can tell me what was the first topic, the first show, um, you're using the hashtag boy things after dark, you will be the winner of uh, a credit with a lime or digital. I have a call. Hi, good, 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 good evening. Thank you for calling boy things after dark. Who am I talking to? Mario. Mario. <laughs> Wagamuji. 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 Yo, and there one. So, are you saying that men cheat or we don't cheat or why do we cheat? Black men don't cheat. Oh, black men, I do thank you for that. <laughs> yeah, man, black, especially Jamaican men, we don't cheat. Yeah, we right. don't cheat. Boys do cheat. <laughs> Boys do cheat, but men don't cheat. Yeah. No, no. So, have you cheated while you're in your boy's fears? Your boy yeah, fears? Man. Yeah. Regular, Why? Regular. Or regular? Let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. See, as a man, sometimes, dog, your man cheat just say, I don't know. You might see all of the Indian and say, you know what? Let me test my looking skills. Just go for the idea, you see me? And something leads to something. So you want insurance so you still have the game, same way. Yeah man, who yeah. don't send me game still lap. Come here and say a crusty, yo, back in the days in a man. When you're ready for go a lucky third year to escape off the street, you see a girl at the point and she has your eyes and you say, okay, roll over there and talk to her. You know what you have to see if boy still have the skills, isn't it? Yeah. Kind of out, it. kind of weird Bossy, in the night and whatever, you see me? Mm -hmm. So you have to test your skill. So it's... that's how when in a boy stage. Right. A, you see me? So, so man, you know, sometimes man cheese no fear, it don't have to be a reason, dog. Man just cheese because we can. Because we sometimes, can, naturally. This, no, naturally, and sometimes we like it. Okay. Just because enough, enough, um, homosexual man, they both know. Them single ladies, yeah. Who are getting in for service, them engine? You are a mechanic. <laughs> mechanical engineer. Mechanical engineer, right. Yeah. I love your profession. I love that for you. Yeah. But let's ask a quick question before you cut Mario. While you were cheating, were you in love with your girlfriend at that point? Yeah, yeah, but the thing is, you know, you tell me, so when I cheat, I find a girl like, well, like, with me, can not work with him, because my woman, she, you have to pass the at this person. Because he's a, he's a boy, I'm a very blunt and still for him. He had my girl, I'm like, come on, fish, and then, so I said, you know, so I say, that's what I said, I'm not running for this. If you say, yo, shoot me a picture. Shoot her the picture, and she said, I wouldn't find a woman. If you say, she passed the at, Test. They are good to go. They are good to go, isn't it? So, so basically, you you make your girlfriend or your woman assess the girl where you got cheated. Yeah, man. So you go back to her afterwards and say, babe, you know, say, did you get the flatty and it did nice? Or 
No, I'm going to go in at least. Yes. Okay. I'm going to be a female or a female. Facts. So if you have a she, you go to the books and she realize that she has, she has a GLE machine and you be around GLE the people who don't be a GLE machine. You can't really ask if you're good. You know, so that you have a GLE machine. Yeah, right. Uh, you know, you have to consider that feeling. They just say, oh, see, you know, it's not money, it's just normal. You know, you know. Yeah, so you have to consider her feelings as it relates to yeah. getting the yeah. intricacies or the details of the cheating yeah, but then yeah, as man. it relates to putting your foot in not literally but as it relates yeah, to putting your foot in you don't know say you go to her and you say yo babe you know so i'm gonna see her one catty though i'm gonna feel like they're gonna knock it yeah man oh yeah, wow man. wow so currently so, hold on yeah, i want to ask you this just, I find a female way you can talk a certain way and all know yeah say but yo. all right hold on the yeah. more let me ask you something. Is it a yeah. case where she's okay when you come to her and say, yo, you see a girl way, you want um forget intimate with? Repeat, repeat. repeat. No, I'm girl. asking, right. is it a case where when you go to your girlfriend and say to her that, babe, um, check out the girl, tell me what you think. Um, I want to have sex with her. What is her reaction? I bear in mind, my be um is open minded. So I would just say she's like bisexual. You dig? So now I have three sums oh. and then something there? That's one. Yeah, yeah, dog. <laughs> regular. Yeah, but yeah, like right. so if it's a regular thing, um No, it's not it's not a regular thing like that. Okay. That's when we say regular in a room like a room. Okay, okay, yeah. But but I don't like it's an everyday thing, thing but it's just no, but the one thing, or two times. The thing is my wife is overseas. Whoa. Oh. Oh. That's oh. a reality no. She understands certain things. Me tell my woman that she can do what she wants for dinner. But me know my woman. She not she do, not do it. My woman fly in for that. So me know say she not going to do that. Okay. But well, me still give her the go ahead because I'm just be realistic. Because when, me, when the engine to service, I'm going to do She can just go to a mechanic shop. Mr. John's mechanic shop around the road. Sometimes my man just says, you know, just think outside the box and be real. Mm-hmm. You don't be a foreign thing. Mm-hmm. You can't tell I don't cheat. You cannot tell I. Well, that's kind of true, still, yeah. Don't cheat. If you tell I don't cheat, you're not going to know it's possible to be true. That is true. She can't tell you, so she's not going to do it. So sometimes you just say, you know what? Do your thing. Do your thing. I might you say, you do my thing. So hey, just do your thing once in a while. Yeah. You're just not going to disrespect yeah. her. Well, that, yeah. well, that kind of makes sense, still. Every girl of me know, every girl of me know, and me cheat with, they know she's a wife for that. And as long as you kind of put that right. If we have to come and jump in like them on the left and the right, them, they, them just have to walk and leave them in the street. I love the game and the game is nice. So we risk, need my team. We respect though, Mario, you know, because we have but another call for the line here. No, me a man, no. So you don't really do certain things no more. No, no, no. I have a brother, brother. Respect. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm. What next caller? <laughs> Why the man know said jelly like <laughs> <I> said, <laughs> Thank you so much for calling Boya Things After Dark. Who am I speaking with? Boy, that's so festive. Yeah, so festive. <laughs> uh, before Boy, caller, uh, uh, people are actually saying that they can't hear the callers, Martin. Maybe if you can fix something. Uh, caller, can you just speak up just a little bit louder for me, please? It's as loud as we can speak. Bro. Yeah, man, we can't hear you. Yeah, my man, here you know. What else are you doing, brother? Yeah, like I said, boy, the week of festive, bud. What makes Shelby go on such a... Shelby, you see, as a side girl, I respect Shelby, you know, because Shelby understands, say... You understand? If you see something, I'm tell them the woman them all the time, you know. Don't, no weapon from against you shall prosper. So if a wife is in your, in your place, just know, say, you can't get the man. You understand? So yeah. Shelby is understanding of that. But do okay. you cheat or why do you think men cheat, though? Um, all right. First of all, there are millions of reasons why people cheat. Men, different from women. But let me, let me, let me get into the men side. Men, uh, as I said, it's not, as a general thing, not all men are like this. But men are more physical cheaters than Fox. emotional cheaters. Fucks. Yeah. Am I, am I, is, can anybody vet what I just said? Yeah, man. No, man, I really think you're Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. Ah, cool. Now, when, when. Beat them, crack them, them. Hope in other world, them catch it, and if them catch it, then. While I'm in a relationship, then it's whatever. However, mm-hmm. you have certain cases where men, like, now nah, get what I'm supposed to get out of the relationship. Mm-hmm. Or there are certain circumstances that um, 
led you to make certain decisions. And in hindsight, you think shit, you shouldn't do this the right. You should, sorry, shouldn't have done it that way. Mm -hmm. But it happened, and ah, uh, it 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 it's tough because I've been in a situation where the timeline was just so so it was wrong, and um, man, stuff happened like it. it, it <sighs> Boy, I, did rough. <laughs> did rough. I didn't get your name. What's his name? Donovi. Donovi. Oh, dirty Donovi. <laughs> 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 it's some Oxford Christian Donovi, my DJ, by the way. So you can go and follow him at Dono underscore V. So Donovi, when you cheated in the past, right? Um, were you in love with your partner? At that moment, mm, it, it, not, not, not no. necessarily, no. All right. So no. And another question is no. Um, were there like a definite reason for say I was just not pleased sexually, or is it was like an ego thing, or was it something that was beneficial to you? Come on, enough man cheat to because of financial reasons too. I can definitely say that. <laughs> nah, the, it was the first reason. It was it was more. Um, you just never happy. It was, and I stepped out. Not stepped out. I meant I came out of the situation, meaning I said, yo. I'm not happy with this. Let's not do this no more. And I came out, you right? Mm -hmm. But then, for some reason, me and my um, man clown self decided to help. Man clown, the clone, the one going on. Mm -hmm. Yes, man clown, because man was a clown. Yeah, um, I love this year at all. I go back and say, yo, let me try and make it work. Because I really did rate this beat. Mm -hmm. This girl. Sorry, I see people that fight people for saying beat. But I really did rate this girl. And with their going to like, a good amount of years and say, oh, let me give this another shot. Mm -hmm. However, comma, um, I hadn't happened to meet someone else right after I had called the first one off. Okay. So, yeah. So, while meet somebody and we say, oh, I could try a thing as a friend with benefit situation. But you're festive. Ex, hold on. My ex came back and said, yo, really ready to make a try make this work. And then we said, Make try and work out fun so however when that happened not, we didn't even get back together we were we were we had this mutual exclusive thing mm -hmm. and when that happened um i was still talking to the one who i was trying to benefit to so you see how that kind of gets so you basically you know, was just tangled wrapped up and tangled up not in jesus but yeah. in a, a relationship <laughs> with a bag of different different people but question though before you go uh mm -hmm. so what led you to say, oh, this was it? Like, were you just now saying to yourself that this doesn't make no sense? And you just decided to say, oh, Ray, you got caught? Or, or was it the fact that you got caught? Uh, no, no. The, the first time it was, no, the, I got first caught the second time. time. The second time, time I got caught. What a full of time, too. <laughs> no, meaning the first <laughs> time I, I called it quits on the relationship. Okay. I was saying, yo, this not going to work. Let's not make this happen. And the no second way. time? But the second time the relationship ended was because I got caught. Oh my God. So men just cheat naturally because of our own selfish reasons then. Compulsive. Basically. Yeah. Basically. basically. And yeah, it was selfish. And I, I, I almost daily regret making the decision because now I know it's not worth it. I hope really in the next relationship, you don't go back oh, in no, it. No, and if you cheat again, I'm going to load you up and... Upon the internet, may not ask Christ, may I tell you, men should not be cheating. But respect none of you for calling in. You understand? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Uh, uh, so I'm going to read a quick tweet. Uh, someone said, "Sexy body underscore Shan." She said, "Women don't cheat; they have replacements just in case and backups." You know, so oh. man, a wiki do. I can talk about this for another episode. No, no man, I talk about this for the next episode. Man. No, no man, <laughs> women normally have a A, <laughs> B, and C. You know, this yeah, month. Month. I, I, I think I turned oh, around. Oh, <laughs> oh, next <laughs> caller. Hi, good evening. Thank you for calling Boya Things After Dark. Who am I speaking with? Hi, my name is Khadija. Hi, Khadija. And where are you calling from? Kingston, Jamaica. Oh, Kingston, Jamaica. St. Andrew. And um, why do you think men cheat? Some men cheat for no reason at all. No reason at all. And others just unhappy in that relationship. So some and men cheat because of no reason. Can you speak up a little bit louder for me, please? Yeah. Some men cheat for nothing at all, can you? I was in a relationship with somebody, man, for three years. Three years. 
And this whole time, my girlfriend, you know. I, I never know. A question. Is this by chance cards done? Yes, she's the one. Oh, oh she's the one. <laughs> all right, cards done. So let's go in a little bit now. So you say some men cheat for no reason at all, right? And you say something more for three years. Can you just go, go back to that just a little bit for me, please? Yes, I was in a relationship with somebody boyfriend for three years. Oh, you manage that though. You did with another girl man for three years. Yes, strong, strong. You could have yes, done an old degree for you. Oh. So, I know. I, how how the percentage shares go? How the how the is it like an annual return where at the end of the year you send out a a, a profile and say, all right, you have these shares of him, she have these shares. How it go? How it go, you know? But I want a year she see him and miss him more than I. She in the army. <laughs> <laughs> no man, clearly this girl in the army. So the girl see our own man one time a year, and you say the same man. More than the woman, but my question to you though is, did you at any given time say to him that, babe, you know, said so this not right, you can't have this girl, I look like an idiot, and you are take the girl man for three all years, like you do one degree? Well, me must tell the man that's in a female relationship, it's true. Uh, it's, it's true. At any point in time, though, did you, did you by chance hint at having an official relationship with him? She don't want that. Ah. I mean, three years, Gary. A long time, but also, no. did you have a did you have another man? No. You never have another man. No, you did love him. Time. Come on, girl, you're in love. <laughs> the boy did have a buzz then, but clearly the boy have a buzz. <laughs> boy did have a buzz. <laughs> so in essence, you're just saying that men cheat because they can naturally. Yes. All right. Just because. Just because. All right, cards. We're going to go on a quick break, but thank you so much for calling, boy. Things after that. Continue to listen. Okay. Why is she festive, boys? Man, I like no yeah. festive. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for calling, boy. Things after dark. Who am I speaking with? Hello. Maybe the person I'm not great. Hi. Good evening. Okay. Ha- oh, okay. All right. Well, once again, the contact numbers are for the Digicel. It is eight seven six two nine four two nine four. <laughs> For that zero two zero two seven five, <laughs> and for the lime it is eight seven six two one two nine eight two four. I don't want to outside, you know. But now I ask that I can barely see. What about next caller? Hi, thank you so much for calling. Boy, things after dark. Who am I speaking with? This is Joe. How are you? Hi, Joe. And where are you calling from? I'm from New York. Oh, big foreign. Well gone, Joe. So. <laughs> Do you believe that men cheat because they can, or is it that men cheat because they are men and men are trash? I mean, I think it goes both ways. Mm-hmm. I've been in a situation where um, I've been cheated on, and the reason wasn't really, it didn't make sense. Mm-hmm. And it's like, to me, it was kind of like living a double life. I mean, I've also been on the other side of like, being the side piece, not really a side piece, but just a game with a one piece. Say so, the game a one piece, but the one piece was a one piece leg or like, was it like a one piece breast. Like which one of them? Both. Oh, <laughs> yeah. But when you say one piece, though, like <laughs> was it a frequent thing or was it just like a one off once in a while? So unfortunately, unfortunately, it happened only once. But maybe after Corona and Jet blew free up, and you know can happen again travel for your man take a plane <laughs> come feed your man i love that for you man i ask guys joe so he's in a relationship clearly how long no has in a relationship he, and how long has he been in a relationship for i i don't know i don't care to know about that oh yeah, yeah careful. you just want the boy you just believe say you're supposed to take the boy i mean it was fun it was good so why not so the boy about I'm have a big buzz. Oh, buzz like big. big buzz, <laughs> boy. So, like, so that, that the festive. No one that festive, but like Christmas. Listen, mm-hmm. we're better, we're better chilling in the morning. And, you know, we connected. Yes. And it was it was fireworks after that. But question though, like, do you feel some type of way, like, for you to be taking the joy well, out of somebody else? New York, I'm have my life. But do you have a man? Yeah. So you have your own man, but you, you take a next girl man. That's not for when we come to Jamaica. I, listen, I visit every Christmas or during the summer. So that's my little, you know, Stella got her this back. So when we come, you know, 
And I don't, I come for like four weeks, maybe five. So, so you don't feel a way to see a game on bun? Ah, uh, man, game, you, that, you hear me say that was on my mouth? Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Man, wow. I love this. But I just want him if he's hearing this, and I'm sure he is. That when I'm back, all right, Joe. A, I'm gonna just know? ask you just one question, and for me, hear my voice, right? You know, your voice is nice, by the way. Oh, thank I you so much. Oh, <laughs> Come on, uh, just let him a DM look a bit. I just okay. want to know who is this, right? Just for research purposes. I, I, can't, I don't kiss on self, sweetheart, because if it was you, I wouldn't do it to you. I'm going to just want you to tell me, like, where name start so. with? Guy, love uh, the people in business. Where name start with? <laughs> <laughs> I can't feel like I know how we know. Uh, where name start with? Uh, you slide in the DM. <laughs> yes, please and thank you. Thank you so much for listening, Joe. Continue to listen. Thanks. Yeah, well, you too, darling. Yeah, man, boy, I think so. I'm after a that, feel like I'm not a woman. I ask Christ at any time she's coming on my DM. <laughs> I hit. Yeah, man. Why not? Wow. So, it's, no, like, we need to so tell her I'm sliding on my DM. No, 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 no. It's only one DM any, any woman are, are on this program is going to slide into and is the host of the program. No, but we need for now. No. I remember say it's him I say you don't want a relationship. We have our next caller. <laughs> so I thank you for calling Boy at Things After Dark. Who am I speaking with? <laughs> Hi, good evening. Hello. Hello. Yes, I'm hearing you. Oh, I'm oh. I'm hearing you intermittently. I'm not quite sure what seems to be the issue. Just a minute. The question I'm in cheese, right? All right. Mm-hmm. I'm hearing you now. My apologies. Can you just state your name for me, please? Shai Shai. Shai Shai from... Aliandra. From Oh, Aliandra. Where are you calling from? Yeah. I'm calling from Kingston. Kingston, at the moment. Think Kingston and St. Mm-hmm. Andrew. Right. And why do you think that men cheat? All right. With my experience, men really don't have a reason to cheat. Wow. Well, mm-hmm. Let me tell you how it goes. Because men officially are dirt, period. I have wow. this egg. <laughs> I was in like, them say young relationship kind of sticky, but we did love the boy. Like, we you love the boy. Co- yeah, long yeah. before I write you. Right, true. Right, true. <laughs> but, but be, be honest about it. Yeah, <laughs> speak your truth, so, sweetheart. Well, me transfer from you know country come to town mm-hmm. and all certain welcome to Kingston and St. Andrew country girl them nice they buzzy like, like yourself leave them call country town people call country right. but whatever so yes now come to town me plan for study and get my subject them and cut me this boy cute and everything still about them calabar use yeah but anyways right. me and this you right, first me and this you get right, together all right, all right pause for cause so, shy shy for the mm-hmm. fact that you are dating or you have dated a Calabar old boy, really and truly, I, I'm no, I'm not really believing in your story again in the book. A Calabar never really make no sense in the man. But, 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 you know, I would give you an excuse because you just a come out town so you feel like the boy, it makes sense. You understand? Yeah. Right. Yeah, pass. You know, yeah. Pass. So I'll give you a little pass. You know, if you went to the but Jamaica anyway, college, I'd understand. But yes, continue. Well, uh, my cousins come from those schools, so you mm-hmm. can't be right. But anyway. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> But anyway, so me and this guy get together and what have you. So uh, November was his birthday, so we are supposed to go to him. Peel me. My friend them did a show me a couple of vibes, but then no, uh, me so fool. Yeah, yeah, my dears. Me can't say that. Me so mm-hmm. fool now. Him say, oh, him phone did dead, so whatever. I'm doing with him. So, all right. The whole cool. birthday? Me and by now, me want this boy because the boy look good. Like me. Yeah, so a couple yeah. down now. I we'll find out to them of this. I have one next girl. But she, a uh, wifey, me never know me a psychic because if you're if you a top man, you need to say, Yo, you know, I have a girl, but right. me communicate. Have a want to try a thing, isn't it? Mm-hmm. If you did come and say that, no, the do thing about You know him honest to say, Ray. Right. All right. But the reason why I never lift up after this girl, man, you know, the girl did right and then she did go ugly plus tax. But it really hurt my soul. So me I say, Oh, so, so when them girl. bright and when them ugly, you just take them money even more yeah, because them mm-hmm. not yeah, supposed to have, ugly. yeah, them not so supposed to have the boy. Yeah. Because me, because in a country girl, them take right through. Right through with the yam. Yes, right through the yam. Yam head. 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 Yam I see him when you're the girl in the palm of my skin one bit more. You see too, she did prime. You see if I did girl there when you just relax herself and they in the bag of talking. Because I don't believe that if you're a wife, you're not supposed to argue with no girl. Fox. You're supposed to know your space. You yeah. see me? Because 
she have it special wife and then he never come and say no say you have a girl or race. So Muda say, ah, what have you? You know me a wife myself, you know. Because alright, after the whole conversation, him go on him most way, I say, you know what? I don't need this because it's not like me up you like she. <laughs> me better than this right now. So who determined though? Because out of the relationship now, him come, she come start me from different Instagram page. Like, girl, me leave your relationship alone since then was intruding. I'm going to leave it alone. Mm-hmm. Now she come. Um, I don't know why you did that trouble my man. Girl, me left your man, so what's the issue now? So, our man call me. Mm-hmm. Well, I know. You get nice. Our man call me. Say get nice. But don't want to do that over the other no more. I want you back. Come back. So, I say. So, me show the girl the screenshot. No, now. man. The man, the the man girl, tell you that. call me and cry. <laughs> But if it's you me, me believe in her um like I'm not believe the girl if you look like idiot no and say, Yeah, what are you? She did she did kinda of piss me up, but me I said then again I have feelings I'm gonna want a man be with me so. Mm-hmm. Get me I say so mm-hmm. I kinda talk to her and I make you know her work. By the time I don't know what the boy go tell her, the girl come cut me you now. And come more and find me a reward. Over the man? Over the man, but, but the boy. So, so I just run with the boy, she still bother me. She find my friend them, she got through everybody. But that me I sure say man man I go forever be dirt for me because them not them not appreciate when some girl cause if she love him, she had do all of that they try to keep her own. You get me I say? Right. But man I have no respect we see when girl I go crazy over them, them not show them. Our women need to realise to that men will tell you anything as well. So, him can have 10 women and him can easily tell her, say, hey, what's going on? I'm going to lift my girl and really and truly, him now caught. I'm going to lift the girl. Yeah, me did pick up that. Yeah. So, me did leave him alone because, me I said, no. So, you leave him and the ugly girl alone because the girl ugly, you said. Yeah. God knows she's ugly, bad. You have a picture with her? I have a picture. I have a picture. Hold on now. So, you see, you see like how you're going to send Karim the picture? Just answer one question for me. You used to go Queens? No man, somebody in the timeline so that they know you. But then if I want to email to them, but I will retweet the tweet when the show has ended. But thank you so much for calling in. Yam tick for in and such. Yeah man, thank you. <laughs> but you see, oh the girl said the girl man. You see how life got? So the girl ugly, so she feel like say she's supposed to inner the girl life. But really and true though, is that the man's fault though? Women that more understand you know because. Sometimes I feel like say, if we never did get it so easy, yeah. we would have just build, brother. You understand what I'm going to say? But I just feel like say, because so many women, no matter if you're in a relationship or not, they're going to still there with you. Willing. Really not able. Yeah, so I, some men just take advantage of that. Fuck. Yeah, some men just take, take advantage well, next of call the up? opportunity. Hi, good evening. Thank you for calling Boy at Things After Dark. Who am I speaking with? Good night, Harvey. Wow, why are you coming in so like you can fight me? Bad to bad. What a good thing I'm far in my day. If I jump in, come with them a credit done. It's a lot of calls. Remember, say, boy, I show have a buzz in the sun of people I call the phone, you know. But thank you for calling, though. No, what is your no. name? <laughs> my name is Shadi. And where are you calling from, Shadi? New Jersey. Big up, big friend again. Yeah, I love that for you. And oh, <laughs> why do you think men cheat, though? All right, so, you see, the man is something they know. Yeah. Them, you feel, so them, them, them cheat. You have men who cheat for all kind of different reasons, right? Mm-hmm. You have men who cheat because they're very egocentric. And you have men who cheat for self approval and peer approval. Facts. Say, oh, yeah, the man, yeah, they send them. Yeah, right. Facts. Right. You see it, and all of that. And then, me feel so, like the whole cheating thing, that's just too much. It all comes down to satisfying, right? Satisfying, mm-hmm. not settling. If right. you settle, that mm-hmm. means that you're really okay with what you have. But right. with satisfying, you're okay with what you have right now, but you're working to get better. Mm-hmm. So if you're there with somebody and them not hundred percent, you go and satisfy, and then communication comes in, and you make them know what you expect. I don't know where it's that. And that's then true. that comes that down. Hmm? That is true. That is true. Yes, I'm agreeing with you. Yeah, and then it comes down to. Yeah. I feel I'm a hundred percent for leaving, not cheating. Same. If it comes down to the person not meeting you, um, a hundred percent. That is so true. 
Let me always say that. Let me feel like say, yo, if you're in a situation and the partner is not, you know, what you would want, or if the partner is not satisfying your all of your needs, not just sexual needs, but just feel like say, it's where they just communicate that. And if it's continuing, you just cut. There's no reason to step right. out of your relationship. You understand? But you know, I am all for the women, and I do know that us men will put you guys to a lot of pain and trauma, and I must apologize for that. You understand? Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, and then you just have the man them will love like Jesus yeah, from the foreign them woman them. Peace, <laughs> yeah, them peace for life mm-hmm. and that though kids. Remember, so we love foreign things and foreign clothes, miss. Remember, so the Irish spring after smelling of the clothes. I mean, you have the man them will cheat for 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 the boss I too. In in the sense of yo, for have it for say yo, here what I've been with that woman before. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Real but thing. overall, men are trash. I do agree. Don't agree with me, cheater. Don't agree with me. <laughs> You're out here cheating on women. But thank you so much for calling in, though. I do appreciate it. Continue to listen. Yeah, sure. All right, thank Bye. you, darling. For well, my next call. <laughs> <laughs> see you. Yeah, see you. You're so much woman. I call about the man. Yo, the man I, I, I call you. Know. Man, I call the I thank you for calling Boy at Things After Dark. Who am I speaking with? Hi, you're speaking with Brittany. Yeah, man, I do have a lot of calls tonight, but thank you for continuing to try, though. Where are you calling from, Brittany? I'm calling from White Waters. White Waters, where's that? Spanish Stone, Zero. Oh. oh, okay. But thank you, thank you. I'm not really too like the Spanish Stone thing, yeah, yeah. but man, yeah. I do. Yeah. Let me just say this, though. Big up to everybody who is listening from Spanish Stone. I realize I get at least five calls a night yeah, from Spanish Stone. Of Spain, De La Vega. No, sir. But, um, no. I realize that nobody. <laughs> yes. I realize that nobody is speaking of the fact that some woman are demons. Brittany, some yes. Girls. Speak yes. up yes. a little bit louder Brittany. for me, please. Yes. Because yes. I want them for ear. Say you say some woman are demons. Yes, some of them are demons and they put themselves in the way. Mm-hmm. So, How so? Elaborate. I know a friend. Mm-hmm. I have a friend. Yes. Right? She had a crush on a young man for a very long time, for mm-hmm. about a year or two. Mm-hmm. Right? Until she got with him, you know. So the girl started the man for two years. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yo. She, she do a little research. So mm-hmm. I boy a woman and all him something. Yeah, right. And when she found out that he had a girlfriend, you know, she just decided, okay, it's so a one sex thing, and then that would be it. Mm-hmm. But then one sex leads to Second. one year relationship. Yeah, man, three, when three the sex buzzy, then no. You can't go in there for just one it's knock and that's it, you know. Yeah. Be just a it's knock and a knock like you're a jump player. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. Good, yeah. 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 So she knew that he was in a relationship, but she had to respect. So if she see them a road, if she see them from the timeline, she had to behave herself. Yeah. But then she still pursued the man though after realizing that he had a woman. She did. So the girl is a proper proper demon girl. Man, I ask guys. Agree. Yes. She had that. Yeah. Agree. So you're saying that some woman put themselves in the way. Um, you know, knowingly that this man is in a relationship and knowing all of these bases, them still go in it. True. That's true. Oh, well, well have you, have you ever done it, Brittany? Self-control. Ask her again. Have you ever done it? Have I ever done it? I don't want to answer that. I'm, I'm speaking <laughs> up for my friend. All right, Brittany. Um, what you can do though is you can pass this information on into my DM for research purposes. And I do appreciate you for calling in. All right? Okay, no problem. Yeah, man. Respect. But my DM was full by the time you reach home. And I ask. Yeah. <laughs> Our next caller. All right. And yeah. once again, the contact numbers are 876-294-0275. That's the Digicel number. And for flow, that is 876-212-9824. If it is that you don't have no credit, you can WhatsApp call and all these things. Uh, we have a next call on the line. Uh, thank you so much for calling Boyer Things See After Dark. Who am I speaking with? Yeah, man, this is Sean from Massachusetts. <laughs> <laughs> Easy, Sean. Sean from Massachusetts. Welcome, welcome back again to the show, brother, brother. Oh, oh, what are you <laughs> saying? Brother? <laughs> Why do men cheat? Again? Why do men cheat? Um, I feel like most men, we don't have self-control or 
mm-hmm. we just don't care or we'll go into a relationship knowing that we we not believe in monogamy mm-hmm. but we we are try trick um the crowd or whatever you know or ourselves but it's sound like you're speaking from experience Sean. yeah cuz he keeps saying we, we. <laughs> don't, don't generalize me please my big <laughs> don't do that so when you no, have cheated I, in your past relationship or present what was the reason for that um just to be clear i don't cheat anymore that why do we don't answer this on a lie so people grow no. time people grow <laughs> no brother real thing man. no I, uh, I mean yeah the same thing as as jamal has said this is like from you it is you know what i mean but um in terms of them time you know you're just young and you're, you're buzzing and you're having fun you know what i mean mm-hmm. you're not necessarily ready to settle down okay. but so why know, that can't be communicated it, though why is it that right. when we get into a relationship and you know you know clearly you are an experienced gentleman so I'm going to ask you a question so why is it that when you get into a relationship and you realize that hey I can't settle down with one person why this can't be communicated to your partner why you can't say yo babe you know say ray because what if she's understanding of that fact no absolutely right I mean, sometimes we're too late. like i mean the, the same like all right, so the older guy Mm-hmm. You know, you realize that yo, you are you definitely have partners out there that share similar interests where you don't even have a cheat. You can tell the girl like, yo, you know, sir, I want to bring somebody mm-hmm. else in the relationship. Are you speaking or, from experience? You know, sir, I want um hypothetically. Speaking, okay. Right. Saying, <laughs> You're open, but it's right. cool. <laughs> I love yeah. that for you, sir. So um yeah, and yeah, so and and to be honest with you, for me, and one of the worst part is I guess karma. When you're ready for second down, after you give how much burn over the years, you just mm-hmm. get some burn under your skin. And you know, yeah. so the, the, when when man get burned, you know, the worst. Trouble, you know, nah, like, Yeah, my prayer to father got burned my karma every day still. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, nah, like. God, no, put it to yeah, God but prayer, I man. mean, I mean, to be honest with you, uh, what, what I would say is that women, Zine, cheat just as much if not worse than us the only thing is that women yeah, are better at hiding their cheating Sean, than man us. Really want them like you, you know, so no man really them. but that is our next topic all in itself and <laughs> we're going to have this on the show too because nine, I feel like say, nine, nine, 9 out of 10 times I ever give bun she was in a relationship thank you Sean Hey, we're going to, this is going to be my next week's topic. But come, I feel like we love not the man them too much and go on, like say oh, woman man, out here I cheat worse than enough man yeah. but basically just to you know conclude so you're saying that you know in your younger days you don't know say but can I really know better you don't do your thing but now that you're older you can understand that it's best to just communicate that hey the one partner thing is just not for me absolutely yeah and you can bring a third or fourth or maybe fifth partner can you remember boy festival and boy love the things them get yeah, a you get a you in of course yeah find yourself a- pardon me <laughs> no, yes, yes, I, 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 no, no, you talk for yourself. You know? <laughs> you talk for yourself. I have never yeah, cheated before. Right. Right. <laughs> you're not afraid of God. Yeah, Yo, but, I mean, and the man sit on the side. I'm a God. No, what is? What is? <laughs> yeah, but I'm not believing that. I don't think cheating is necessary. I mean, if you can't do the one person thing, you just make the person know straight up. I, I, you know, I just communicate your intention from early. That makes sense, make and I. Like, and I do thank you for calling, Sean, for Matichuta. <laughs> thank you so much for calling, brother, brother. Respect, isn't it? Yeah, my pleasure. All right, folks. Well, you're my next caller. Hi, good evening. Thank you so much for calling. Boy, your things after dark. Who am I speaking with? Uh, good evening, Chad. Chad? Yeah, man. Is it Chad from Portmore? Yes, sir. All right, Chad. <laughs> A long time I've been praying for calling, my brother. Go, go on, yeah, man. Uh, oh, yeah, the wire man sheet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, well, I've got three reasons. Yeah, man, the first one, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. The trees are the chase. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. I love you, you know, but man, they feel why. Oh, first thing, we're not cheating, get out of it, that way, isn't it? But as me, I say, but they're you feel why. Yeah. Everything is all good and well, you know. Mm-hmm. But you see, the truth, forget a new girl that gave Buzzy. a big rush. That yeah, man. Anything you have to do with your girl, isn't Fox. it? That's a number one. And the number yes, two, the girl, them now, like, well, like, sit well, in. Hold on, that Chad. You see, Harry McGrees. As no, much as I agree to his point. Everyone walk on like say, oh, them are the biggest guys in the road. Mm-hmm. So I don't want them to really get down. Say, so I'm book a girl like a game. Mm-hmm. Him a latch on Panar. I'm not a little girl. Fuck. Two weeks down the line, if I go book a next girl, I might yeah. pull him attention. Mm-hmm. I know how to go to show when I'm having a say, I'm going to touch one up on the side. Probably touch an next one on the side, isn't it? Yeah. And then, 
We not make girl like the, the man them alone. So only time the girl them, you will pick up a girl. Pushing. I say six six months down the line, a month stay there with mama fully Jesus. Up, man. Yes, man. Talk no man. <laughs> Talk no <laughs> man. In your buy all like one car, where you go every night, you go. Say you go every night before you know, but yeah. Yeah, you know, man, you know, the car make you have a boss there now. Every night. Yeah. Show up with you with the same thing there, and then you have all that to deal with, and you go call like a girl, probably all at work. Where? Yeah, mama can just vibe on a chat on a ball game on a party and everything. You, Naturally, you might straight to that girl is the man and a full year of all. Your girl just drive away, but the woman him don't accept that. So I'm asking you a question before you cut Chad. Is yeah, it that when you cheat, right? Um mm-hmm. are you in love with your partner? Because some people feel like say if you cheat on your partner, that means that you don't love them because you're putting them in a position to get hurt. And nobody not supposed to hurt them partner. So them is man. it that when you cheat, um, do you think that we're just not in love with our significant other? No, I'm sure you that one day. It's love and respect, isn't it? Yeah. So to me, only as far as we can show you about respect, me out there and I'll Jada Kingdom I back it up for me. But me I say, no, you know, say, Mama, I'll go do you, respect her. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But can I love that Jada Kingdom come and me I'll put one for her? If the respect now, I'll die as well, isn't it? It depends. <laughs> yeah. John, let me tell you the man we don't wait for your call no, but trust and believe it but respect brother I really do appreciate your call yeah, alright uh, we're going to go on a quick break uh, this is our 10.30 break we're going to be right back on Boy Things After Dark right here on the new stock 93FM follow them book them you know outside to open back if you're not follow me on social on my socials you can follow me on Instagram at uh Kareem Boya Things and on Twitter it's Boya Things on my business page on Instagram is Boya Things you can follow me also on well subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're not just go over YouTube right now and subscribe it is Boya Things by Kareem we have a goal which I reach by the end of this month you understand what I say we have a next call on the line I thank you so much for calling Boya Things after dark who am I speaking with hi good night hi good night where are you calling from I'm calling from Portmore. From Portmore, what is your name? I don't want to say. Yeah, man, that good man. Give me a name so it can work with something. I call you Sue. Sue. All right, love. All right, Sue. So, Sue from Portmore. Why do you think men cheat? Because they want to. Because they want to. Particularly. So, they just do it because they can. Yeah, right, right, right. So, in addition to that, I was listening earlier. Mm hmm. I remember your guest saying that. You know, sometimes people just have a connection. Mm-hmm. And that's true. Sometimes you have a connection with somebody you just, you really can't explain. Right. But you want to act on the, connect, on the connection. Mm-hmm. You so, get involved. So sometimes you're in a relationship and you might meet somebody and you just feel like, say, you have a connection with them and it just happened. True. So them just cheat based on a connection purposes then, basically. Sometimes you know, the connection to see where it will go. Yeah. Let me just ask you, Sue. By, by chance, were you ever a side chick before? Yes, I was. And did you feel any way, shape, or form about that? Like, I just never business. No, I'm never business. I love the boy. I'm not like. <laughs> you love the boy. You're not like. I love that for you. I'm not ask guys. So, okay. you are. So, while you were in that situation, how long were you in that for? Two years. You were a side chick for two years. years. Yes, sir. So how long in the day with the main girl for? I'm not sure. Pretty much, pretty longer than I was with him. Pretty longer than you were with him. And um, did you feel guilty in any ways? Like you ever tell him, say, yo, you have to stop this because your woman love you and them something there? I think I have. You think you have? I think I've said that to him before. How did it end though? Because after two years of being in um something with him, regardless of him being in a relationship mm-hmm. how did it end or why did it end i wanted more you wanted more i wanted more so after a while yes you want more you want the date mm-hmm. you want the gift you oh dates and gift so why did i give gifts and all these things too you want to go to the family be not you want them to hold on pause for a so so you're the side chick and you were going to the family dinner no, I wanted those things. Oh, you wanted that, but you never get it clearly because, right. right. I wanted more, I wanted more, and I just felt like, okay, I can't get any more. It's not going to move from this level. Uh-huh. So I 
it to leave. So did he promise to give you more? Because what I realize is a lot of men who are these cheaters, dirty trash, them feel like say when them have the side chick them, them promise to not bugger things. You understand? And he then we say no. He did. He did. The boy did carry him a The boy are wicked. Oh, him promise. The boy yeah. are wicked. And of course, sometimes I believe the man then other times I just know that that's not gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have to be realistic. You right. Know, to hang up. I've accepted the truth at some point. That's it. Right. I <laughs> Uh, so you just basically broke off that whole connection because you just feel like say you know this not gonna make no sense for you and you wanted more you know but all of the body full of buzz you just they feel like say yo you know what yeah. you wanted he couldn't give it to you because clearly there was somebody else in the picture right i mean it was best at the time where i, I found somebody sorry for me to look somebody who can give me what you wanted more than what i'm for. right so yeah. Have you have you since found that? Yes, I have. That the girl said she find it. <laughs> <laughs> so is the case where you still you still engage in psychic activities now, or that's not that's no longer a thing. Um, you learn your lesson, you know. You learn your lesson. Yeah, right. you okay. Learn your lesson, and you have to want more for yourself. Wow, I like that for you. So <laughs> I wanted more for myself, and I went after it. So no, I don't engage in those activities anymore. Anymore. So basically, you're saying that the connection thing is kind of real still. It's like no matter if him love the girl for two, him can meet somebody that offers him that connection, and him just he really actually can't help himself. True, and sometimes the connections aren't even the same. Right. Not the same. Facts. Well, that makes sense still. But thank you for calling those two from from Portmore. I, I I appreciate you and you know continue to listen. You're welcome. All right. All right, thank you, darling. Thank you. Uh Davian, question though, do we have any more what's up? Credit. But I will give you a bag of credit in our WhatsApp for you. I I show me them some of those read them out on the timeline so whoever want them can take them. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna take another call. Thank you for calling Boya Things After Dark. Um, who am I speaking with? Hello? Hi, good evening. Hello? Yes, hi, good evening. Who am I speaking with? Dan. Jeez, <laughs> so, I'm not like those Dan's. So first of all, I just called to, like, I'm really mad about the whole demon girl thing. What we need to focus on tonight is a serial cheater in the studio, okay? That is what we're here to the talk about. serial cheater. Right. Mm -hmm. Wow. Which is whom? So, that's that's dangerous, no. The, the serial cheater identified himself. So, okay. Right? Yes. So I don't need to say anything else. So, no, I don't like the fact that we're shifting and dying to talk about women being demon girls or whatever. Mm -hmm. That's not important right now. What is important is why men cheat. Right. Of course, we had a discussion on Saturday about this. On the podcast, but, which is going to be released on Sunday, right? right. Mm -hmm. But I don't. But I mean, I don't, I don't see why nice is need to be shifted to focus on what women are doing. What we're talking about is why men I cheat, do. right? So why men cheat? So if it's even if you as a woman know that you need to have a woman and whatever, that has nothing to do with you. Still went ahead. Mm -hmm. You as a man, you're still the one doing the action. You're still the one cheating because that woman probably might not be in a relationship too. Right. So that is what you need to focus your attention on and. And look at the reasons why men cheat, whether they're valid, yes or no. So let's not. Yeah, I kind of feel like we are, we are, we are trying to justify to shift the focus for say yes, woman exactly. are wicked or woman are demon, right? Right. 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 Nothing to do with women being wicked or demon. Right. At the end of the day, it's not like you put a rope around in the neck and say, and say "Come, baby, after cheat." After you no know, goat, yeah. <laughs> man, I go cook some right. curry with you, sir. Right. <laughs> I do. I right. see. Mm hmm. So, analyze say nobody are forced to play for cheat for your woman or whatever. At the end of the day, you still make a conscious decision to say, yeah, all right, never give my woman bone, not once, not twice, but multiple, multiple times. times. So, let us not shift the narrative tonight and let us just focus on why men cheat. And I am, yes, I'm, a, I'm definitely agreeing with you, Dan. And so, but thank you so much for calling once again. You understand? If I get a more caller for the night, I know say you are going to always call. I don't ask guys. Oh, she got disconnected. Okay. Um, I'm going to read out to Flow Credit. 
uh, we've been giving away a lot of credits based on you know you subscribing or and or following a uh, seven legends clothing on instagram that is our sponsor for the credits for tonight so i have two flow credits here that i'm going to read out uh if it is that you have a flow phone take it out now please and thank you and the uh the first number or, or the first credit uh the first voucher number actually is one five zero two five zero four three two nine zero one seven two once again that is one five zero two five zero four three two nine zero one two and the next flow voucher number is one five zero four eight one zero eight seven six six seven five seven once again that is one five zero four eight one zero eight seven six six seven five four and uh we have a next call on the line correct thank you for calling boy things after dark my name is kareem who am i speaking with hello good evening hello hello hi good evening who am i speaking hi. with hi yes, let's say her name is niche niche, niche. and where are you calling from calling from kingston oh kingston and saying hanju you're at niche yeah. and why do you think that men cheat because men are trash <laughs> Point blank, period, full yeah. stop. <laughs> yes. This way, this, yeah. you're trash. Yes. Full agreement, niche. And why is it that niche? Because men are just men. They, they, they think because they're in a relationship, mm -hmm. they should go out of their relationship. Right. And just be with somebody that can fulfill their other needs, even though they have the girl to fulfill their need mm -hmm. but i mean if you're going to go out of a relationship why why you can't just be with the woman and say hey babe this is this you can do this you don't have to go out there and tell go out there and find another woman so you feel as if that if if it is that something is missing within the the um the scope of of the relationship yeah. right or if it is that this man you know is lacking something you feel like he should say something and should say hey you know say xyz you know communication yeah, is important you right but what if because i do know that alter men that said that you know sometimes you know like complaining and i don't want to use the word complain but you know like complaining or trying to say babe this is what is, is happening changes. nothing to change or didn't them start get dark mm -hmm. so what yeah, about that the woman and them there is just different mm -hmm. because not every woman is the same so right. when you say, all right then if he's saying that i'm not doing something right mm -hmm. then that self-esteem is going to drop right and she'll say i then you might find somebody else right just take it and say i then fix myself and just do what i'm supposed to do so just feel like say men just cheat because something is lacking and we lack yeah. we lack the whole substance or the whole right. communication skills have yeah, you ever been cheated on communication they lack communication have you ever been cheated on i have have you ever cheated three and a half i was in a relationship for three and a half years and when i left Woman, I DM me, say, them to me a party with my friends, and then should I beat me, and all these things. Beat it over a for, man. For, for a man? <laughs> That's crazy. So, yeah. Men, I love that. Men, so, I love you too. So, uh, did he at any time, after even after the relationship has ended, did he at any time confess or fessed up to any one of these cheating allegations? No, and say, he oh, said no. He said that he wasn't cheating. But you caught him cheating. don't know nothing about these Wow. So, you caught him? Huh? Did you actually catch him, though? If I actually did what? Did you actually catch him cheating? How did you find um, out that he was um, cheating? The girl coming to my DM, oh. like after I broke up with him, like a month after the girl coming to my DM and said, you know that your boyfriend was cheating on me. And I was a side chick for the entire three and a half years. And you feel like you were and doing enough in your relationship though? Yeah. Wow. I thought I was the main woman, but I guess not. Wow. Well, men are really trash. Men are wicked. Men are wicked. But thank you so much, Nish, for calling. Boy, I think it's after dark. I do appreciate yeah, your call. Welcome. Yeah, one. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. 
Boy, I don't know. Man, man can just work it out here, man. I'm not like, brother, you're a teacher. I say man a wicked, brother. Man a wicked. Are you including yourself in that? Yeah, man a okay. wicked. Okay, all right. But just make sure. <laughs> no, man a exclude. Do we have any messages on WhatsApp, Davion? I'm no exception. Okay. Man a wicked. Oh, we have a next so caller. You're, you're not wicked too, brother? No, you, I don't cheat. You've cheated before? No, I have not. And But thank you for calling <laughs> Boy Things After Dark. My name is Kareem. Who am I speaking with? This is Ashley. Ashley, can you just speak up a little bit louder, please? You can hear me now? Yeah, man, yes. I am hearing you, but uh, where are you calling from? Oh, we're well, rocking some people tonight. And why do you think men cheat? Me feel like men cheat because them can't satisfy. Mm. Right? Mm-hmm. To one, to one come out. Man to one cheat. come right out. One of different, different things. Mm-hmm. Starting off with approval from them friends. Mm-hmm. You see them friends? It play a big part in what they do. Mm-hmm. Right? Them ever feel like, say, yo, if the man... I have one bag of girl in staff. That's true. Which is which is not and a lie. Pressure yeah. them friends here. Men think that. You know, they talk to one this girl and that girl. Them never yet approve of one girl. Is mm. it? I mean, you have the men out there that um play wingmen even when you don't ask them to, even when they don't need to. You know, so you go out and I'm gonna tell you, say your ear will go on. No, but you have a man of your own. Yep. You know, yeah. Man. Yeah. Of course, definitely. If you please your woman. <laughs> right? Man just wicked right true. Right true. Right, this is a right true. <laughs> right true. So you feel like peer pressure is uh, Yeah, peer pressure I think that plays a big role in why men cheat. So is it that because men want validation from their friends, like them just feel like say oh if an yeah, abaga girl from the crowd, like you know, a certain type of lifestyle. Mm. Them, you know that lifestyle. Mm-hmm. So, you know, it pressure them, it put enough pressure upon them, say, yo, them can't have a one catty. They will have them one catty, you know, but them, them will go around and do other things where, you know? Right. Yeah, so me see like, and social media, all of them so. Girl. Them just up in your man same way. Right. So you feel like say, some girls just don't care. Like them just no business none at all. Yeah. And them just are run up in your man life. Like say, okay, you have a man and so what? Yeah. So what? <laughs> well, but thank you. <laughs> well, thank you so much for calling. <laughs> you made a valid point, you know, because some man really and truly want validation from them bridging. And no, I don't I understand why. I can't get it. But thank you for calling, though. I really do appreciate your call tonight. Well, thank you for we listening. Man, 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 legend clothing on instagram please go ahead and follow them if you're not subscribing to my youtube channel may i beg you so much time may i say it tonight go ahead it is boya things by kareem on youtube so the digital vouchers are three six one three four nine eight six eight eight zero one nine once again that is three six one three four nine eight six eight eight zero one nine and for the other digital voucher the last for tonight is five zero five zero one eight one nine zero one six two six once again that is five zero five zero one eight one nine zero one six two six those credits were courtesy of seven legend clothing on Instagram, go ahead and check them out. We have our next caller. I think this might be my last call for the night, you know. Uh, hi, good evening. Thank you for calling Boy Things After Dark. Who am I speaking with? Hello, good evening. Caller, are you there? Hearing me? Yes, yes. I'm hearing you now. Thank you for right, calling. So just call me, right? And I just want to say that, yo, men... I don't know. You can give them everything. Uh-huh. You can boom, flick, flick, yes. boom, and they still boom, flick, flick, boom. 
I was with somebody for five years, right? I was with this guy for five years. And out of that five years of living with this guy, mm-hmm. he had a whole relationship with someone else. But out of that five years, not three years, living with that person, you know, so imagine that. I have a man, he come home to me some night and mm-hmm. live with somebody else. And me a boom, click, click, boom. <laughs> So hold on. <laughs> so you on this Monday for five years. Five years. And he was living with somebody else for three years? Yes. So sir. the person we might live with that is his main, I would assume. No no I was his main. But if you were his main, so how he no, no. live with you? Because he knew about me. Wow. He knew about me and she accepted. So when, when I found out and I called her, she said when I, I called her and said like you really doing this? And she said yes. So why the man never lived with you though? Huh? Why the man wasn't living with you? He was living with me. But you know, them policemen are still Jamaica. You can't oh. go on to work and get a yard. Oh, oh so, so... So he never really lived with her was, then? He did have oh, two homes? No, like, I, I saw the three years what I really um, that she was talking about because you know, when I went on Instagram, right? Mm-hmm. I thought I saw pictures from 52 years ago. Mm-hmm. Both mm-hmm. of them. Even when I, even when I went over, he was also over. When I checked on, when I, when I saw the pictures, look, guess what happened? He left his phone one day. I went to work, right? Mm-hmm. And I took out the memory card. <laughs> so. so when I took out the memory card, I saw the three years of the relationship. Even when he was over, we were, we were in 2020. Mm-hmm. And the both of them were together. And you're saying that you lived you lived with this man and you are boom flick split under the bed yeah. boom with the man and a flip boom <laughs> and the man had a whole different relationship with somebody else for three and years and lived with the, and lived with the and man and not even men you know but if you um their family especially the mother <laughs> Yeah, just big up my mother, you. Jackie. Big up yourself. Because my mother didn't do the same thing, but I ask her. Yes, I mean, you, like everybody, I mean. family, everybody you say, yo, you have two, 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 um, two girlfriends living with at the same time. Wow. So he'd, he'd come and sleep with you some nights and sleep with her some nights? Huh? He'd come and sleep with you some nights and sleep with her some some yeah, other night. Y- yes, but based on based on the pictures, all I look about Sunday, they not keep the balls and stuff like that. Oh. That's what the girl told me. And mm-hmm. you were doing all of this just the same. And I was doing this also. This man have two set of clothes. Oh. But that man is full of boss. <laughs> Do you know how yeah, much the man work? Work? No, no, <laughs> seriously. Like this comes out of work, you know. But the bigger joke is that you know get older up to this thing, don't know. Oh. So hold on there, hold on. Okay, but can you tell me to wrap up my show you know? But hold on. So you did a game born too? Yes. For how much years out of the five years? Um maybe for the five years. Whoa. Wow. Yeah. I had respect this nigga that was living with somebody else and then they work at the same place. Oh. I can't call the name because we're calling him. The man know, right. Yeah, right. yeah man, that good man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so she was for, and then this girl usually the things from me and stuff like that. Someone just asked a quick question because we're going to wrap up the show though. So, so you were treating on him the entire relationship and he was treating <laughs> three years out of the relationship. So which one I think did Atta. Did Atta. <laughs> I think Atta. I just want to do it, please. Is it rich that may I talk about? Okay. Oh, okay. okay. That's all you're talking okay. about. Okay. Yes. Yes. He doesn't know. Right. right? So it's just the respect of the whole cheating. Yeah, it was just the respect of him. Because both of us was young and we were young and we were trying something. Right. right. And uh, it's just the way how he is. That's what the people right, so like. I, you, I'm assuming that you would be fine if he cheated with respect. Yes. If he had a little respect to it, I would have some um, type of understanding, some form of understanding. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love that for you. But thank you so much for calling and thank you for listening. Um, The topic next week, though, I hope you can call in next week because you just give me this bright mm-hmm. idea. But thank you so much for calling, though. All right. All right, darling. Have a good night. 
too. All right. Um, so the funny thing is, you know, <laughs> oh, I yeah. do have a bag of topics written down for this show, but yeah, you see, is. based my woman I realized with the woman, them there are people oh, in my strong. DM who oh, want to come on. So next week, I'm going to talk about why women cheat because we're African have a counteract. So I know because you see, she there with the man for five years and she a complaint. So the man a cheat for her for two years, you know, but then she a cheat for the whole five years. Man, that's that's crazy. Crazy. Yeah, we kid. <laughs> but I do understand the respect part about it. Um, if you had called in tonight or if you're listening, listen to me. I appreciate you. I can't thank you guys enough. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. We're still number one trending on Twitter. I think this week has gotten the most amount of tweets so far for the duration of the show. Um, so, so now going with a bag of things and you talk, if you are listening, your sister boy show, I make sense though. You know, mm-hmm. you know, so thank you. I'll be here every Tuesday night between the hours of eight to 11. If you were a credit, uh, winner tonight, you know, congratulations. You know, this is just me giving back and also sponsored. Well, not really sponsored, but seven, seven elevens clothing basically, you know, decided that they wanted to do something good for you. Uh, if you're following me on, if you're not following me, go ahead and follow me on Instagram at, uh, Kareem Boy at Things. Uh, if you're on Twitter, follow me at Boy at Things. Follow me on, uh, my business page, Boy at Things. Also, subscribe to my YouTube, people. All these contents will be there. So, it's Boya Things by Kareem. Tell me your handle real quick, Jambrisco. As much as you guys don't like me right now, <laughs> <laughs> follow me on Twitter at Jambrisco. Yes. That's with a Z. Mm-hmm. Jambrisco underscore. And you can follow me on Instagram at 876 underscore. Greatness. Yes. And big up uh, Jimmy Q. Big up my in-studio producer, Martin, at The Bombcast. Big up my production assistant, Davian. Big up yourself. Uh, Dono V. My DJ, you are listening. I thank you. My guest DJs this week, DJ Shella 876, DJ Spooky, we're not going with a bag of things. I'm going to just read this. Um, you know, someone had WhatsApp and she said, I've been following you for a little while. Kareem, you're so strong and you really inspire me. Please continue to be yourself and always remember you are loved by many and your happiness comes first. And so I'm going to leave you on that note. And, you know, please remember you have a purpose. You are great. You are things. Have a good, good evening. We're going to play a little music for two minutes. We're going to just vibe a little bit. You understand?